one-up us, aren't you? That is one seriously cool temple. Yeah, points for Ivor, I guess. This was a good tip. Well, Jesse? So, are we doing this? I think Jesse's just taking it all in. Order of the Stone, let's get some treasure. Treasure! treasure! for treasure this cupboard is bare come on you know how these places work the treasure's never just out in the open let's fan out and search the place these channels lead to the center of the room they look like they're designed to let lava flow from those channels in the wall why would you want to do that This is cool. Knew you'd find it. What do you think Ivor knew about this place? Eh, who knows? That guy's read like a million books and traveled all over the world. You probably start to learn a thing or two about a thing or two. Thoughts on this place? I think I'd rather be in a straight fight than doing all this switch-pulling stuff. But I'm glad Ivor's intel about this place was good. So, how are you feeling lately? Wither sickness free. I think. Now I'm just trying to get used to having teammates and people who worry about me. That's pretty new for me. It's nice, though. Okay, I'm gonna keep trying to solve this. Yeah? Any ideas for how to fix this? Well, these channels of lava are blocked in strategic locations by those sticky pistons. Unblock them, and I'm guessing something cool will happen. So what kind of treasure do you hope we find in here? Well, I've been working on a build that could use another couple dispensers, but some cocoa beans would be cool too. So, have you been having a good time hunting for treasure? If you had asked me a couple of months ago, I would never have thought I would like all this adventuring and treasure hunting stuff. But this has actually been a really good time, and I've been getting lots of great stuff to build with. Okay, I'm gonna figure this out. Never doubted you for a minute. Blocked again! Hey, 
me, Axel. What you need, buddy? So, what kind of loot you think we're gonna find in here? Oh, man, well, I want to make a room with an emerald floor, right? Well, who doesn't? I'm like four emeralds away, so getting some emeralds would be pretty sweet. Axel, what do you think of the situation? Um, I don't know about the situation. I kind of do more blowing stuff up. So, if you need someone to do stuff like that, I'm totally your guy. Man, we have the best adventures, don't we? Yeah, it's pretty sweet. I was worried I wouldn't be cool enough or smart enough or whatever enough to be in the Order of the Stone. Thanks for always believing in me, buddy. You know it. Okay, I'm gonna keep working on this. Sounds good, dude. It's not. Never mind. and the lever. What's up? Okay, I'm gonna figure this out. Never doubted you for a minute.
likely would have been disappointed if the floor didn't open up into a dark, creepy passageway. This kind of reminds me of when we first found the Order's temple. We were such a scared bunch of noobs back then. Hey, I wasn't scared. No. Then who was it that was yelling, Help me! Help me! The dispensers are trying to kill me! Wow, yeah, that feels like it was, I don't know, a million years ago. We packed a lot in since then. And to think, that was just the beginning. Yeah, and that was before we'd fought winter storms, hung out with Enderman, reunited the Order. So crazy. Bingo! All right, let's see what we've got. Concerning taste, Jesse. I respect that. Huh. A pumpkin. Not bad. I suppose that could be useful if we run into Enderman. And looks like we've got one more thing in here. It's... What did you find? What are you guys talking about? Whoa. That's super cool. I've never seen flint and steel like that before. That glow, is it some sort of enchantment? I don't know. I've seen people put an unbreaking enchantment on flint and steel before, but that's not unbreaking. You could give it a shot and find out. Okay, flint and steel, do your thing. Well, I have definitely never seen flint and steel do that before. Uh-oh. like some monsters have a death wish. So what's the plan? If you ask me, it seems like a good time for a secret handshake. Yeah, so let's use the redstone wrap. Obviously. Uh, I think you mean the warrior whip. Obviously. Olivia, prep the redstone wrap. Nearly there. Okay, activate it. <laughs> Good job, Jesse. Worked perfectly. Whoa, you've so got to teach me how to make one of those. Yeah, pretty spectacular. Oh, all these mobs, where does it end?
here I tell you guys doing that never gets old Woo! yeah not too bad killing a bunch of monsters getting sweet treasure like that flint and steel thing you got to try it again I'd be curious to see it again too I'm dying to know how it works okay what should I burn first the grass no that stump Well, well. Where'd you get the new toy? <laughs> Looks a little, uh, sophisticated for you, Jesse. Order of the losers. Yeah, losers. Ugh, who let you guys out of your cave? Joke's on you, we don't live in a cave. Shut up, you idiot. Ugh, what grief are you here to give us now? Look who's talking. So what are you... Ocelot doing here anyway. The Ocelots were Lucas's gang. We ditched that name just like we ditched him. Yeah, we rebranded. We're the Blaze Rods now. Blaze Rods! Shut up, Gil. Sorry, boss. Don't do it again. Wow, you guys are terrible at naming. That's a dumb name. <laughs> Says the heroes that just called their group the New Order of the Stone. And where's Lucas, huh? The minute the Order decided you were cool... For whatever reason... ...he wouldn't stop sniffing around you like a tame dog. You take that back! Mmm... no. Hey, Lucas is ten times the guy you are. Yeah, Lucas is a hero. Which is more than I can say for any of you creeps. You probably think that thing makes you so special. Classic Jesse. You take all the best stuff and never give anyone else a chance. That should have been ours. Oh, yeah? Yeah! Blaze Rods. There's no shame in being second-rate eight. Not everyone can do what the Order of the Stone can. <laughs> well, that's, that's just what I expect from someone as small-minded as you, Jesse. Hand over the flint and steel, Jesse. Don't make me ask again. You don't get that one. It's supposed to be mine. Some hero you are, Jesse. Fine. What hope do we have when heroes like you are throwing your weight around like this? It's not always going to be this way, though. Come on, you guys. Let's get out of here. Blaze Rod! I told you to shut up! Look out, Jesse. I don't remember him being that angry before. Okay, I'm officially starting to get a bad feeling about Aiden. Threatening people, scary enchantments on his sword. I hope he doesn't hurt anyone. Yeah, we need to keep an eye out. Man, and all because he wanted that flint and steel. What are you gonna do with it? Ivor's the one that told us about this temple. 
He might know something about it. Hopefully Ivor can tell us more about it. Finally starting to recognize stuff again. Feels good to almost be home. Cheers to that, friend. I just can't shake what Aiden was saying about us back there. We do get a lot of treasure. And I guess sometimes we might throw our weight around. What? No. Aiden's got a bad case of treasure envy, pure and simple. I don't know. Well, I guess we do always try and get all the best treasure. Yeah, but that just means we have great taste. Not that we're like bullies or something. Well, no matter what Aiden thinks, there's one thing I know. What's that? They think we're awesome. They're back! You guys, they're back! Run! Tell everyone that our heroes have returned! <laughs> yep, New Order of the Stone is back in town. It looks freaking awesome! Happy to see us scream. Wow, that's new. It somehow manages to evoke skulls and tentacles. While still doing the whole barfing lava thing. Yeesh. Oh, that thing looks completely dangerous. Eh, not my fault! Look out! Oh, uh, help! Oh, stop your whining! What are your pathetic injuries in comparison to my majestic tower? Ivor? Oh, Jesse, you're back! Don't listen to a word these fools tell you. It's a fire hazard! And your face is an ugly hazard! So I suppose we're even. Causing trouble again? Nothing. Just a little spirited debate with the local community. Brain function is proving difficult for them. You need to remove this now! Jesse, all I wanted was what any man wants. A little house of my own, with loads of lava pouring off it. Ivor, I know you mean well, but your house wants to kill people. Dude, you made a killer house. Exactly! Killer! Shut up! What about just moving it someplace else? I'm sure... Move it? Way more lava is going to spill out if we do that. Well, we have to tear it down. We can't let that monstrosity stand. <laughs> It's my house, Jesse. I have just as much a right to build something as all these people, don't I? They're just jealous that I've got vision. Well, they've got... They've got... Community planning. Blech! I'm sorry, Ivor, but your house is way too much of a hazard to the community. Tear it down, everyone. Good call. Ah, it's a slippery slope, Jesse. Today, the lava house. Tomorrow... Who knows what kind of rules you'll be imposing? Don't be a sore loser, Ivor. Fat. <laughs> Haven't seen you around in a while. So what can I do for you? Ivor, we found something in that temple you told us about. What? You did? <laughs> yes. Great to see you again. Let's do lunch. I'll bring the carrots. There's no telling who's listening. Meet me in the treasure room. Ten minutes. And bring the thing you found! Well, if we're gonna tear this down, we better start getting some buckets together to scoop up all the lava. You got any iron? Oh, man, no. I'm all out. <sighs> okay. We better go mine some more. 
We'll catch up with you later. Yeah, once we give this majestic house the funeral it deserves. Right, what he said. Nice work today, guys. Yeah, not bad, right? Mm, it's like we should do this more often or something. Later, guys. Come on, let's go find Ivor. Wow, this place is really shaping up. Guys, you have some pretty cool stuff in here. Crazy stuff. <laughs> yeah, no doubt. Hey, Lucas, great to see you. It's been a while. I really missed you guys. Well, we missed you too. And you have so many other treasures. Boy, you've sure been busy. Oh, wow. You framed it. I'm him. Yeah. How are you doing? him every morning I wake up and just for a minute I can pretend that he's just in another room or rooting around outside looking for carrots and then every morning I get to remember all over that he's gone I'm so sorry <sighs> okay guys I promise I wasn't just here to bum everybody out I actually came back because I need to tell you something it's about this weird run-in I had with Aiden. Ugh, I hate that guy. Whatever you said or did, it really got to him. Uh-huh, yeah, we saw him too. The Order of the Stone and the Blaze Rods are just as friendly as ever. That's an understatement. He's just been so jealous of you and the rest of the Order ever since you saved the world from the Witherstorm. He's convinced that he was supposed to be a hero. Ever since he took over the Ocelot... Mm, the blaze rods it just seems like he's gotten meaner he's pushing Maya and Gil around jealous why he thinks you're a big bully Jesse looting and keeping all the good stuff for yourself so what'd you find that got Aiden so excited anyway check it out wow what a weird glow yeah, I know. I'm supposed to show it to... You found it! Yeah! Whoa! Dude, what's wrong with you? This is the greatest find of our time. I can't believe you're actually... That you're actually holding this. Okay, Spill, what's it do? It proves what I've always suspected. That glow, that enchantment, is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. Whoa. Yeah. Dramatic. Right? So, what's the flint and steel do, then? Uh, not 100% sure, actually. But I suspect that it's related to the exciting part. You see, if these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer to finding the Eversource. What a beautiful sight. Looks like you came back just in time, Lucas. More powerful artifacts, huh? Wow, so is this Eversource thing valuable? Valuable doesn't even tell the half of it, Jesse. Okay, I'm interested. The Eversource is said to be an object of incredible power possessed by the old builders. It was some sort of treasure or artifact that gave them an endless supply of precious materials. Think about it, Jesse. That temple must have been its hiding place. Wow, old builders? You learn something new every day. I'm still just trying to wrap my head around the Eversource. Okay, so this flint and steel might have this old builder enchantment, but how do you know that's where this Eversource thing is? I've traveled near and far, Jesse, and that temple, that flint and steel, is the only firm proof that I've ever seen of the old builders. That does seem like a pretty good bet. Old builders, Eversources, ancient mysteries. You know I'm in. Excellent! I'll pack my adventuring things immediately. Wait, he's coming? Wow, sounds like you guys have a lot to get to. I, uh, guess I'll take off? Nope, you're coming with. I need a buffer between me and Ivor. Let's get moving. This is so exciting. 
exciting. <laughs> Adventure! Lucas, I know it's daytime, but watch our backs, okay? I can't believe we're bringing Ivor with us. I mean, it's nice that he's so excited, but... Ugh, not my top choice for adventuring companion. Hey, you can't argue that when it comes to all this ancient history and treasure, Ivor knows a lot. Sure, that's true. These trees are enormous! I love it so much! He just really gets on my nerves sometimes. Remarkable. Look at this architecture. So old. So exquisite. Oh, this is just how I dreamed it would be. Except for less cake. My dreams usually involve cake. So, you think it's the right place then? Oh yes, Jesse. Oh yes, I very much do. Wow, it looks so different during the day. Okay, but careful what you touch. There could be traps everywhere. Petra, long guy, are you two as excited as I am? I'm not sure that's possible. What? She means that you just seem to be super excited, Ivor. You look excited, Ivor. Excited? I'm ecstatic. Thrilled. Overjoyed. The Eversource could finally be within my grasp. Once, uh, once we find it, that is. Huh, doesn't look like those lava channels work anymore. Pretty cool temple, right? Yeah, it's amazing. I'm not gonna lie to you, Jesse. I'm pretty excited to be along for the ride on this one. Barely got out of there last night. Doesn't look like it's opening up again anytime soon. That's all right. I had enough of the spiders and lava and everything that had to offer already. I can't believe we missed some sort of secret area here last night. Eh, we were kind of fighting, oh, a ton of monsters. It's not surprising that we didn't hit every single nook and cranny. I wasn't there last night. That looks promising. I'm heading up. Fantastic! We'll follow right behind you! Uh, yeah. What he said. So you think this Eversource thing is up here? Hard to say, Jesse. Goes, the old builders feared its potential, so they hid it away in a place where it would never be found. And ha! It never has been! What is Jesse doing up there? Well, that seems promising. Jesse! What do you see? <gasps> Some kind of portal? It's just as I'd imagined. Spectacular. But where does it lead? I don't know. This portal, it's not like anything I've ever seen. Here. 
Here goes nothing. Oh, thanks for bringing this back to me, Jesse. I knew you were good for something. You're pretty easy to follow, you know that? Dude, why are you being such a tool? Your little adventure is over, Jesse. Time to go home. Step aside, Jesse. We're heading through that portal now. Oh, no way! Aiden, you're done. This is where it ends. Fine. Blaze rods! Clear me a path. Going after Aiden, and we're going to take him down. <laughs> 